Hey, what's up guys, it's Phil. Today I'll be reviewing Z-Trade's white dimmable flexible LED clip-on desk lamp, model number X000R4G5VD. Here's what's in the box. The desk lamp, instructions, power adapter, and warranty and survey cards. The power cord is about 5 feet long and is permanently attached to the lamp. It has a USB connector at the end that fits into the included adapter or any standard 1 amp USB charger. You can also plug this into your computer's USB ports. The shape of the light fixture at the end is round and flat, like a hockey puck. It is made of metal and coated with a hard enamel paint. Make sure that the fixture is screwed on tight, as it has a tendency to come loose. The LED bulb is not replaceable. The gooseneck is flexible to just about any shape you want. It has a metal sleeve interior and is coated with a soft touch matte silicone. The base is a strong spring-loaded clip that is made out of metal and has foam padding on the interior of the clip end. There's a ton of tension on the spring, so it takes a lot of pressure to open it, which you want so it won't accidentally slip off what you attach it to. The maximum clip width is 2 inches. The clip also has two bands just behind the clamp ends that protect your wooden surfaces from scratches from the clip's sharp edges. The power button sits about one foot down the cord from the clamp and allows you to cycle through three different modes. The first mode is a cool blue. The second, a warm amber, and the third, a bright white. The light this lamp outputs is fairly bright, though it appears dimmer in the warm and cool settings than in the bright white setting. This lamp provides adequate lighting for a desk or small area environment. The flexibility of the gooseneck is good and can adapt to many configurations and orientations. The only thing to be careful of is that the white silicone tends to mar and pick up dark colors easily, as does the white enamel paint, which is also prone to chipping. But if you take care not to throw this lamp around, it should stay in fairly good condition over time. I hope you enjoyed this review. If you have any questions, please ask me in the comments below. I'll post a link to the product in the description below. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, and join me next time.